Hi, welcome back to Car Mandos. Today we've got a Citroen C4 Picasso in. Um, we're going to do a video of front brake pad change. So first thing we're going to do is get the wheel off. Need 17 mil. Sorry about that, phone went. So, get the wheel off. Turn the wheel out so we can see it. Um, not everyone has a brake wind back tool, so I'm gonna get our screwdriver in onto the brake pad and just push the caliper back. Once you get it so far back, it's easier. Go back, go back nice and easy now. That's the piston all the way back. And turn it back back out. I'm going to take this retaining spring off. Sometimes these can be a bit stuck. That one popped out nice and easy. Spin it back round. Two little caps at the back here. You're going to need a 7mm Allen key to remove the retaining bolts. These are actually the caliper sliders as well. Take them out, give them a little bit of a clean. Get our caliper off. Set that up there. As you can see, these didn't need changing, but customers ask. We've got about five mil left on them. I'm gonna get my drill with wire brush on, give these areas a bit of a clean up, stop the brake squealing. Get our sliders as well. Give them a bit of a clean, get the old grease off them. Get 
And if you've not noticed, we can see from here, um, we're going to have to tell the customer the CV boot split, see if they want us to change that while we're here, but we'll crack on with the brakes for now. So, new brake pads. A lot of people say you shouldn't put copper grease on brake pads anymore, but we just put a little bit on where they sit in the in the channels to slide up and down. can put in the comments below if you agree with it or not. And the rear brake pad sits in, in the piston itself on these. That's it all in there. <coughs> Spin our caliper back over. Make sure you've got no twist in your brake pipe. Sit that back on. We do put a little bit of grease on the sliders. You don't need loads because it just bogs up and then they stick. Start these off by hand first. Just so we don't cross thread anything. Tighten by hand as well. Replace our dust caps. Spin it out. Don't forget our retaining clip. Flathead, just give them a little knock, make sure they're in. <clears throat> Get our wheel back on. Nip them up with a gun. We'll get the car down off the ramp, torque the wheels up, and don't forget to pump your brake pedal. See you in the next one.